a rather large 28 LED USB lamp. Um, got off eBay of course and if I plug it in here it lights quite brightly and it draws, because I tested it earlier, 370 milliamps. So um, before I open this up I'm wondering what value of resistors it's got in it and how many resistors. Is it going to be one resistor for all the lamps in parallel? Or are they going to be divided into two banks? Or are they going to be divided into four banks? Or is it going to be one resistor per LED, which is extremely unlikely? But anyway, let's do the maths before I pop the lid. So, it's 5 volt, and the LED voltage will probably be in the region of 3 volts, equals 2 volts to drop across the resistor. 2 volts at uh, 0 0.37 which is 370 milliamps, but that's three, uh, 0.37 amps. So, note the new high contrast calculator, now I've ripped the horrible bezel off the front. Um, so, R equals V over I. Uh, actually, let's work out the power dissipation as well. But um, 2 volts, uh, the R equals V over I, 2 divided by 0.37 equals a value of about 5.4 ohms. And the power dissipation will be 2 volts dropped times 0.37. So it'll be dropping about 750 milliwatts. So that would point out possibly being, if it's one resistor, uh, one resistor, that could be a 5.6 ohms, which is a really standard value. It's the one of the industry standard values. And I'd, I'd want to rate it one watt, but it'd probably actually be half a watt. If it's two resistors, uh, they'll be double that value because they're dropping half the current each. So that would either be 10 or 12 ohm. And again, about half watt each. If it's four resistors, the nearest values would be about 18 or 22 ohms. They might use a 20 ohm, but let's say uh, 20 or 22 ohm. 22 ohm is one of the very standard values, so that's not a very good omega. And that, in that case, you could actually use quarter watt. So what's it going to be? Is it going to be one resistor, two resistors, or four resistors? Uh, what do you reckon? Let's... Uh, Open this up, shall we? Or there could be active circuitry in it, but you know what? I don't think so. Not for a cheap Chinese product. I think I got this a while back, and it's just been sitting there waiting to get taken to bits since. Could be nice to actually swap the um, LEDs for warm white LEDs, if it's all on a circuit board, which I should think it is, but you know, you never know, it might just be plastic with holes in it and the leads folded through. So what we got? Two resistors, well, let's take a look at the back first. Yep, two resistors and two clear banks of LEDs with a resistor driving each. The resistors are common to the positive 5 volt rail um, and then they're dropping either side. They look to me like quarter watt resistors and their value is brown, black, black, 10 ohms. So 10 ohms, but uh, not half watt. They're, uh, I wonder what sort of voltage is being dropped across them. So let's plug them into the USB power supply and get the meter. I guessed I'd be dropping about two volts across them. Guess there might be a slight drop across the um, cable as well. So let's get the meter into shot. In fact, I'll just get rid of this paper over here. And the voltage being dropped across the resistors is 1.8 volts. Pretty close to the two, 1.8. So 1.8, um, the current was 370 milliamps, 0.37 divided by 2. So 
point one eight five. Uh, oh, point one eight five times. And what was that? Um, it was one point. I'm not getting a good connection there. One point eight. So times one point eight. Yeah, they're dropping about 0.333 watts, a third of a watt each, which is not too far from the quarter watt. I'm sure the Chinese don't let things like that upset them. But it's a nice enough light, and uh, it's nice that they at least did, didn't just use one resistor for the whole lot, but they probably just wanted to use standard quarter watt resistors, and that was the minimum they could get away with. Meh, reasonable enough. I might uh, convert that to warm white later on. Yes.